Bryson, congratulations. You're this week's Uno, Uno's Pizza, a River Bluff Boys Player of the Week, and uh, well-deserved. Coach Bennett was telling me that, man, this past week going up against Dutch Fork and all their, their stable of wide receivers, you had six or seven PBUs, and he said you played as well as a cornerback can play against a talented team like that. Just talk a little bit about, uh, about facing those guys and the fact that you were able to do your job and, and really limit those guys. Uh, it was it was a good opportunity too to play a good team in the state. You know, good receivers, uh, probably some of the best receivers I see all year. And uh, it was a tough challenge, but I think I did pretty good. You won you won the Bull Gator Award here, which is the premier award of the week for any uh, a River Bluff football player. And again, coach was bragging about you to me a few minutes ago, and he said uh, he said though he said go ahead and ask him about about those guys. Get a little scouting report. He said because you you'd be hard pressed to find a group of wide receivers better than that group. So give me your after actually having to face those guys. Give me a little scouting report on the Dutch Fork Whitehouse. Um, they they run a good bit of routes. Uh, a lot of fourteen yard comebacks. Uh, they start to throw the ball up a lot, little streaks and stuff like that, but they they good though. Did you surprise yourself in how well you played against them? Yes, I did. Because <laughs> Coach was, he said, man, he goes, that kid showed that he's a football player. Now, you're only a sophomore, and uh, obviously you got two more years in front of you. Uh, just talk a little bit. About, I know this is a tough year, man. I mean, you guys are you guys have had a tough road and uh, uh, in, a, in probably the toughest region in the state, uh, in Region 5, 5A. And, Talk to me a little bit about how the team is hung in there. Again, Coach Bennett was just telling me that one thing these kids haven't done is quit. They haven't hung their heads. They're still fighting and clawing like like you're supposed to here at River Bluff. Yeah, I know we're a young team, but we, we know that we're a young team, that we doing pretty good competing in this 5A region and the game we played so far. Mm -hmm. uh, we know that sooner or later the years to come, we're going to be, we're gonna be a team to watch. Yeah, I've heard that that sophomore class that you're a part of, something else. Yes, heard a lot of talk about that. Blythewood this week, obviously another tough opponent. Uh, what have you seen of them? What do you know about them? Uh, Jordan Adams, a uh, very scrambling quarterback. So we got to make sure we stay on our on our men and stuff like that when we're in coverage and stuff like that because he likes to scramble and hopefully keep him in the pocket. All right, Bryson Gorman, the Uno's Pizza. River Bluff Boys Player of the Week. Enjoy that great pizza over there, man. Well-deserved for a great performance last week against Dutch Four. Thank you, man.